basic grips. So in judo, there's the main way we tend to grip on this lapel is it's like if you put your hand right on their chest and then they're going to grip. And we like to keep the palm towards the chest because we can feel where the part where the person's moving, any direction they go. In jiu-jitsu, this, this isn't so good because obviously there's a wrist lock sitting there and the upper level jiu-jitsu guys are so fast that go ahead at hooking that and, and locking it. So one of the variations I do especially is when I grab this, I immediately rotate my knuckles into the collarbone. And I may be a little bit higher right there, but the main reason I do that is it immediately starts causing a little pressure. And as you can see, he can't wrist lock it and he wants to bend a little bit. So now I'm getting him bent over for me. So that's where I like to be. And sometimes I'll even turn this palm to me so that I can pull them in and keep them tight. The other grip is palm up and I go right behind the elbow. So if you get the point of the elbows right here. I'm going to be right behind it on that tricep. And I concentrate on the last three fingers in both hands. That's the strength of our grip. So when I get to here, I've got this grip up on the lapel and I've got this grip on the pinky here. And the first thing I do is give a little turn so I take all the fabric out and I keep this real tight. It just makes it harder for him to be able to rotate his arm inside of his gi. And I can keep a really, really tight position here. So no fabric here, a little rotation here, and all of a sudden I've got a really strong position on the inside of our bodies right here. The other grips you'll see, you'll see some people slide out here to the end, but the same concept applies. When you grab here, you'll see them kind of gather this up and turn it. So once again, there's no fabric. So if you want to play out here on the end, that's fine. No fabric there. Keep this hand turned. Keep your elbows in a little bit. If I'm open, uh, especially for guys who like to shoot legs and stuff, I'm creating a space. Here, I've got a defense. So if he tries to come forward, I can drop the elbow. I can turn this elbow in, and you can see how I can rotate his body. So these are just real basic grips.